Hey, welcome back to North Coast Logging. It's episode 127. If you like the videos, go ahead and uh, leave a thumbs up or a comment and let me know. If you want to keep following along with the series, uh, hit subscribe and hang out. Uh, last episode, which I know was uh, two weeks ago, sorry about that. Um, we were uh, using this machine to do some uh, limbing. So uh, I think that's what we're gonna jump right back into, is doing some limbing. Now, uh, the last time I played uh, Farm Sim was over two weeks ago, because uh, I posted that video two weeks ago, so it was probably a few days, or even closer to three weeks ago, since I've uh, touched anything. I am gonna be relearning some controls today. So I just have to, uh, well, bear with me while I do that. It's always a little bit difficult to uh, take some time off and then come back. Um, even worse when it's not a machine that I'm all that competent with to begin with. But we're gonna try. So far, so good. Can't see, but. I suppose that's just realistic, right? <clears throat> See, did, oh, that's not good. How do I get this thing? I guess I haven't made that mistake yet, have I? There we go. Let's go drop this thing out. Well, that wasn't too bad for being pretty rusty. I'll take it. Oh, oh boy. All right, let's see what we... There must be a tree up there that's getting in our way, but I just can't see. I mean, that makes the most sense, right? We're in a forest and everything. We're logging. Of course, there's going to be a tree in our way. I'm going to assume that we got that one. Let's see if we can drop it right in the same pile here. Somewhat, oh, look at that. That was almost professional. Well, except it didn't land exactly where I wanted it, but it felt good for a second. All right, let's see here, gotcha. Okay. When I made this plan of selective cutting and limbing for longs, I didn't really think this through, did I? Try to do all this limbing in densely forested area. It's probably not the way this is supposed to work. Good thing it's a video game. So I can be dumb. Also, I hope that my audio is a little bit better. I was having issues the last time I recorded. Just uh, getting my new microphones to work. Now that I think I've got them working, I'm uh, just not sure that I have my settings set up well so it sounds good. I did some tests before I jumped into this one, but um, only briefly. You guys will have to let me know if it sounds bad. Let me know if it's like too bassy or whiny or unclear. Yeah, leave me a comment. Let me know if it's bad or if it's good. You can you can tell me that too. I'd appreciate it. Oh, and I'm sorry, you're gonna hear me clear my throat. Uh, I was traveling for a week, and then I came home and got sick. And I'm still getting over a cold. So I got a pretty nasty cough. I've got a pile of cough drops on my desk in front of me right now so I can record some episodes. <laughs> Doing my best.
Oops. <clears throat> Excuse me. Sorry about that. I know nobody wants to be listening to somebody just coughing and throat noises into their ears when they're trying to watch a video about logging. So random question, any of you use these videos for like ASMR? Because that's what my girlfriend does. I mean, obviously she doesn't mind having my voice in her ear when she's going to sleep, but um, I was thinking about that. I wonder, are my videos like boring or maybe not boring, soothing? Well, maybe boring actually, I don't know. Some of you don't seem to think so, which is awesome. But I would imagine there's probably other people that are like, what, farm sim video? Who plays farm sim and then of course who does this random logging stuff that's really not even the intention of the game. <laughs> anyway, if you do that, let me know. I'm be curious. I won't be offended or anything. I, I don't care what reason you have for watching my videos. I just appreciate you watching them. Bunches that we've gotten done so far this episode. That's cool. That didn't take, oh, what would that take? Like five minutes? That's not bad. Maybe I'm not as rusty as I feel. Where can I wiggle through here? I guess right here. Should fit. It's just, yeah, I'm gonna have to pull up next to these and then back up so we can have a better position. Whoa. All right, we gotta hop out and take a look. What is going on here? Aha, that's what we did. Oh, let's grab that. It's a screenshot, that's a good one. So we should be able to push this arm forward and then tip back. Cool. It worked like I thought it would. All right, it's okay. I gotta, I gotta throw another cough drop in before I start coughing in your ear. Or maybe you're like me and you have like speakers and a subwoofer and stuff over your desk, and it'll just be. Extremely loud. Anybody watching start to get some nice uh, spring weather over the last couple weeks? Like I did at my house. I mean, not like great, but we're at least getting some 40s and 50s, even though it did just snow like two days ago. But still, we had a few nice days mixed in. I really enjoyed them. Getting some sunshine after a long winter. Summer's my favorite time of the year, so it's getting to be there soon. And I can't wait.
Well, not bad, I guess. been so long since I had recorded or anything, I actually had to go back and skim through my last episode that I published just to see what I needed to, to work on. So I have no idea what I was talking about since I didn't really watch it, I just skimmed it. What the heck was I talking about? Did I have a plan? Oh, I'm just kidding, I still kind of know what I was planning on doing for the future. Has anybody tested out uh, FDR's newest update with uh, like his normalized tree weights and stuff, his new physics. It looked really cool in his uh, patch notes video, but I haven't downloaded it or played with it yet. Definitely opens up like a lot of possibilities for this series using other mods and different maps and I mean, all of that stuff sounds pretty cool. Maybe I'd actually do a run through Silver Run, which I tried when I first bought it, but without FDR's uh, improved uh, tree physics and stuff, I gave up on that pretty fast. It just isn't quite as enjoyable. It's a video game, so if you're not enjoying it, why the heck are you playing it? Anybody remember the uh, Assassin's Creed Black Flag came out, I don't know how many years ago now, seven years ago? I was playing that earlier today. I was having a good time with it. That game's pretty fun. I know I'm like way behind the times, but you know, sometimes you just pick up those old games randomly and when the uh, mood strikes. I tried to open up Cyberpunk again. Uh, yesterday, but I don't know. One of my mods must be out of date in it. And, uh, I just really didn't feel like going through and trying to figure out which one it was. So when it crashed on startup, I just closed it and that was that. Still a good game and I should just play a straight vanilla playthrough on it, but I don't know. I can never seem to do that to any game. I always just want to mod them. There's always something that catches my eye. Probably because I just got so used to simulators and all of the third-party add-ons that exist for any one that you name, except maybe Construction Simulator. I don't think that one has any, any mods, but pretty much all of the rest of them do. Pretty choppy here. What do we got? What's going on? Do you think we're getting stuck in front or behind? Ooh. This is a great view for everybody, isn't it? Just head first into a tree. Good luck seeing what you're doing. That one there. Can I even get there? Oh, I can. So those of you who are like me, looking forward to summer and nice warm weather. And got any big plans? I've got some fishing trips planned and I'm excited about one coming up in May. That'll be pretty fun. But 
That's about it. Maybe some camping. Maybe some island camping on the boat or something. That'd be pretty cool too. Let's do that. Okay, drop out. There we go. Um, that said, with the nice weather and cool. Maybe we are going straight. Maybe I'm just turned that far. Yeah, there we go. Anyway, like I was saying, uh, with summer weather coming and that being my favorite season, um, I've got some outdoor hobbies that are definitely going to take priority for me. So I'll probably uh, knock back to like a video or two per week instead of five. Um, I'm still going to keep trying to record over the summer, but you know, if a camping trip or something pops up or the fishing is really good or whatnot, I'll probably focus on that instead of making videos, but I'll still come back. You know, I'll still be around. I can still help answer questions and stuff if you guys have them, just leave me comments or whatever. Or, uh, you know, on the rainy days and stuff when the weather is not as nice, i probably still pop and make a couple of videos at a time so I can post at least one or two a week. At least that's my tentative plan. We'll see how it goes. Kind of surprised that I got that to fall in there as neatly as I did. I just don't want to leave you all hanging all summer while I just take my time off to go enjoy everything because uh, so many of you have been so supportive to my videos here and I really never expected anybody to want to watch anything I was doing. So that's awesome and thank you for that. Um, so I feel like I, I owe it to you guys a little bit just to keep making some videos. At least at a reduced level instead of nothing for four to six months. Let's see here. I can see that one bunch up there. I keep looking through the trees to see if we have anything else. But... That one over there? Oh no, that's just that one random tree that I screwed up. This thing's kind of hard to drive through the woods, isn't it? That big boom sticking out the back of it. All right, let's go around these trees and come back up to that bunch that's just off to our right there. Uh oh, look at that tiny little stump stopped us. blind spot. Crazy, right? Alright. There we go. You guys are like me and you love fishing in the summer let me know what your uh, favorite method of fishing is or your favorite fish to go after sometimes I like chasing ones that I can eat but other times I just like to go out and catch ones that are fun like bass but I've been getting more and more into like pike fishing the last uh, couple years 
big toothy critters are pretty fun. Oops. Can we do it? No, we cannot. We're gonna have to reposition to get that one. Got one stupid tree is getting in our way. Okay. It still looks like it's going to be on a funny angle. Can we do it? Yeah, there we go. Cool. Oops. I want to knock our other bunch off to the side. Make more work for ourselves later. are sliding all over the place, aren't they? Alright. Let's go get this last bunch over here. Fan. Anybody watching the playoffs for the Stanley Cup? My team got missed playoffs this year, so I haven't been watching, but I did see the uh, Maple Leafs got stomped on by the Bruins, which is funny. Sorry to any Leafs fans. Not really. You guys deserve it. You know what's coming. But uh, yeah, if you're a hockey fan, let me know which team you're uh, rooting for in the playoffs. If you just want to laugh at Toronto with me, that's cool too. I can see another bunch in front of me, and I spotted some off to our left too when I was repositioning, but let's just get this one done.
controller turned off. Come on, connect. Still a problem with a Bluetooth controller. I wait for it to connect every time, and it turns off when you're not paying attention to it. Okay. I think we're gonna end the episode right there. That's been about long enough. My girlfriend made dinner, so I'm gonna go eat. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.